St. John 15, 13 say, Greater love have no man than this, that a man lay down his life for his friends. Love have gone from our world. Love have gone from our world. And the reason why I say love is gone from our world, look at the killing in our land. We got abortions, innocent babies dying because a mother decided to abort the child. We got killing among cops, killing black and white, but especially the blacks. And where's the love? And it seemed like the more they're killing of us, and we want justice. My friend, Riley won't do it. When I say Riley, protesting, won't do it. We need to turn back to God. We need, we need to turn back to God. We have forsaken God. We worship the devil. Yes, we worship the devil. We worship the green monster called money. Some of y'all get stuck on the, on the scripture say, money answered all things. But you forgot about the Bible say, the love of money is the root of all evil. So love have turned to money. Love is gone from this world. Look at, look at our, our young people. Look at our elder people. They no more marriage. It's all about sex. It's all about push it in, take it out, have a baby. Then you don't take care of the baby. You let, you let your grandmother take care of the baby. You don't take care of the baby. You get up and leave when you want to leave and leave the baby on the mother on your mother care. Love is gone from this world. Nobody wanna get married anymore. Marriage is a bad word. Love is a bad word. It's all about killing. It's all about, you see a black man in a car, you think he's an animal. <laughs> Come on now. Where, where is the love? Love is gone. And the reason why I say love is gone, because people ain't going back to God. <laughs> why well, say love is gone? Because people's not going back to God. It's all about these false pastors, celebrity. Where, where, where's the church in all this killing? Come on now. I know Al, Al Sharpton out there. I know Jesse Jackson out there. I know all these so-called pastors out there. But they ain't doing nothing for the killing of an innocent man. Love is gone from this world. Hallelujah. That's, especially when you're black, you get back. When you're white, you're right. Except, glory to God, the man that killed George Floyd. Hallelujah. He won't spend his rest of his life in jail. But I, my friend, the Bible said, an eye for an eye and a tooth for a tooth. He, he, that, he that lived by the sword must die by the sword. So I'm saying this, my friend. Love is gone from our world. They no more love no more. Look at the street, look at, look at North Carolina. Look at North Carolina. They are adapting the footage of the body cam. Love is gone from our world. G young girl having babies, they ain't getting married. And they're bringing all these bastard children in this world. Ill Ill illegitimate children. They, they no more home. They no more fathers in the home. And you think, you think love? Love is gone. These girls have babies and they want, their, they want their mother to take care of the baby. They don't want to take care of the baby. They buy all these stuff for themselves. They ain't buying nothing for the babies. Love is gone from this world. And it's a shame. Love is gone from this world. Look at, look at, look at the death rate in our world among African Americans. Now, I'm not, listen, I'm not being racist, but I gotta tell the truth. I'm talking about love. I'm talking about people don't know what the meaning of love is. Love is not sex. 
Can y'all young people hear me say this? Can y'all elderly people hear me say this? Can, 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 can young adults hear me say this? Love is not sex. And my friend, if a man put his hand on a steering wheel, don't mean to shoot him. Hallelujah. If a man try to drive away, don't mean to shoot him. Glory to God. My friend, what, what, what you saying, preacher? I'm saying love is gone from this world, meaning that God is still here, but people don't recognize God is here. Look at our churches. So much scandalous going on church. Our, our pastors are pervert. Come on now. Our pastors got mischief. Our pastors are homosexual. Our pastors are lesbian. Come on. Now. Where is the love? The love is gone from our world. And my friend, God is looking down upon the church. What is the church doing but taking people money and lying on the pulpit? Hallelujah, my friend. What you saying, preacher? I'm saying love is gone. Love is here, but love is ignored. Because people don't know, people don't want, don't want love no more. They want sex. They want money. They want recognition. They want to be, to be famous. They want to be popular and all, have all the degrees. Hallelujah. And guess what? They ain't doing nothing for the people needs. Love is gone. Even among my children, love is gone. Hey Amen. It's not. It's not about. It's not about. Uh, f thank you. F thank you, Father. Thank you, Dad. Thank you, Dad. It's all about me, 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 me. It ain't about love no more. You can't. A person can't call their father and say, "How you doing, Dad?" Love is gone. Hallelujah. When I was growing up, my friend, I at least call my parents almost every other day or every day. Especially when they're old, especially when they're senior citizen. You don't wear your parent out. You don't have you don't have babies and, and expect your mother to take care of your baby. No, find the father. I'm not just sticking on this subject, Lord. There's many subjects, my friend. I'm talking about the love is gone from my world. People are cold-blooded. Hey Amen. People don't have love no more. People think love is money. People think love is material thing. People think love is cars and, and cash and clothes and, and castle. That's not love, my friend. Those are material things. Hallelujah. And I'm in a series, my friend, about glory to God. Hallelujah. The four kind of people in the church. Hallelujah. We got the we got the hallelujah. We got the people on the wayside. We got people on a stony ground with no root, people that are thorn, people that that, that that wilderness, and people on a good seed. But today I'm talking about, my friend, where, what happened to the love? The love is gone. People don't have, the Bible said, the love of many shall wax cold. People don't love no more. People see you on the street dying, they walk over you. The other day, I was coming from the garage. This man was in a staircase. Hallelujah. I looked at the man and and I didn't see if he was dead or not. And that's why I put a garage, I had to turn back in the garage and see if he was alive or not. But he was just asleep. But how many people would stop and see if the man was dead or alive? My friend, we don't have love no more. Look at North Carolina. Look at Minnesota. Look at California. Look at Georgia. Look at Columbia. Hallelujah. And I'm saying, not justifying what the cop did was right or wrong. Hey Amen. Uh, he should have shot that girl four times. What, he was shot in the air or something, frightened him. But don't shoot her. Don't shoot her four times. Shoot a leg or something. Get her attention. We got to shoot. Bang, 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 bang. Shoot on animals. That's a problem we're having in our world. Racism. How the ra you say racism. The white people think they're good. They better each other. And the black people think they better at each other. And just the white people are racist. Because the black people are racist too. I'm not just talking to a white man. I'm talking about a black man. My own people, my friend, are racist. Some of y'all Americans, y'all think y'all the real Americans. Y'all not the real Americans. The real Americans are Indians. The real Americans, my friend, are native Indian, and y'all just here because y'all came on a banana boat. Y'all came on a slavery boat. But, my friend, it comes to a point right now, the churches is racist. 
Yes, the church is racist. The, don't, don't tell the church recognize you if you got the degrees, if you got a dollar, hallelujah, and you're popular. That's it, my friend. If you're a person like me, I'm not recognized because I don't have a degree. I'm not prestigious. I don't, I'm not in the cliques or the circles. Hallelujah. I don't, I don't cross my, I don't cross my T's and dot my I's. But guess what, my friend? The Bible said, warn to you when men speak well of you, for so do the father to the false prophet. So I'm not a false prophet. I'm a true prophet of God. Because I don't take, I don't take, my friend, when I look back at, over my life, I went to too, too hypocritical church. I said too hypocritical church, my friend. One church, my friend, pastor was adulterer, and the other pastor, my friend, he got questioned behind and in front of his name. Hey, go to God now. Now I went to four churches now. Hey, go to God. I went to Grace. Hallelujah. I went to Christian Cathedral. Hey, go. I went to uh, 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 Seven of Christ. I, I went to Greater Mount Calvary. So y'all you, you don't know which church I'm talking about. And that's good, my friend. But what I'm saying today to somebody out there, my friend, the love is gone from our world. And we as being church people, we got to do better than we're doing. We're not praying. We're not seasoning. We're not being active in the community. We're not, we're not winning soul for Christ. We're not we're having street ministry. We are too selfish. We're too much into ourselves. We're too much into the cash. We're too much into, into material thing. We're too much into money. We're too much into degrees and don't care about them, about people's needs. Our love is gone. Our love is wax cold in our community, in our church, my friend. Especially the love is not in our church. Hallelujah. Glory to God. What kind of Jesus y'all say? Y'all ain't serving Jesus the Bible. Because Jesus the Bible, he loved everybody. Y'all don't love people. Y'all got conditional love. Y'all don't have unconditional love. Y'all don't love people. Glory to God because they got money. Because they're very popular. They, they're very prestigious. Some of y'all, y'all go after the, the mega pastors like T.D. Jakes and, and, and Joe Osteen and, and Juanita Biner. Hey, glory to God. Come on now. Joyce Myers and Paula White. Come on now. The, the South Africa pastor in, 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 in South in, in my ministry. What I'm saying to you, my friend, the love is gone. Y'all so much into prestigious celebrity. Y'all so much into, into rock stars. But it's no time, my friend. It's time to love one another. The Bible say, my friend, great love have no man than this. That a man lay down his life for his friend. You are my friend. If you do what I command you, y'all ain't doing what God command y'all. Hallelujah. I, and I, listen, my friend, I've did so many videos, and it's not about me. It's about people to recognize that there's a God, and his name is Jesus Christ. You're going to be holy. Hallelujah. And some of y'all, y'all preaching, but y'all ain't living nothing y'all preach. Y'all singing, y'all ain't singing nothing y'all sings. Y'all, it's all about the money. Yes, I say it's all about the money. It's not about Christ. It's about the cash. Hallelujah. It's not about a master. It's about money and material things and man. Oh, what happened to the love in this world? So many killing and we, and we the church ain't doing nothing. What is the church doing? The church, my friend, we ought to we ought to come together and have a revival. Hallelujah. The only thing I'm concerned about is having a big car, a big house, a big a jets and clothes and shoes. My friend, come on now. Are y'all going to heaven? Are y'all striving to go to heaven? It's time to wake up and show love. Love. The Bible says the last day, the love shall be wax cold. It's here right now because people don't have love. The Bible said the devil come to steal, kill, and destroy. Look at that street, my friend. It's not the white man. It's the devil. I ain't saying the devil. The, I ain't saying the white man is the devil now. I'm saying the devil motivating people go to God to kill. Hear me. Hear, please hear me out, man. Please hear me. Hey, Amen. I'm saying to you. In closing, the love have gone cold. I say that the love has gone cold in our world. They no more love no more. Hallelujah. We are we are we become threat for each other. You can't you can't walk in the street before getting robbed. 
You can't, you can't get, get stopped without getting sh shot down if you're black. Hey, what you saying, preacher? I'm saying the devil is on a rampage. And the devil don't, know, don't care who he jump into. He don't care if you're white or black. He don't care if you're rich or poor. And we we got to wake up, my friend. We got to wake up. We are asleep. And especially those that call themselves Christian, what are you what are you doing for the community? Hey Amen. Y'all so much, y'all so much heavenly money, you're in a, you're in an earthly good. Yes, that was earthly good, you ain't heavenly heavenly minded. But it's time as a church, it's time for us to get up, shut up, and move out the way. Amen. Well, I say it's time for you to shut up. Move out and move out of the way. Because some of y'all, my friend, just going to talk about a tree that don't have no fruit in it. Cut it down and cast it in the fire. Hallelujah. My friend, it's time. It's time for us to start showing love for one another. It's time to support one another. It's time to, to show, hallelujah, it's more than one fella in the ship. It's called fellowship. Amen. But we, 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 we ought to do better, my friend. Yes, we ought to do better. And especially my children. We ought to do better. Stop having all these children not, 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 not be married. 